Welcome to Sandwiches of History. Today from handy household hints and recipes of 1916 sent in by Austin Gary. Uh, we're going to be making the ham and olive sandwich. Naturally we start off with chopped ham, chopped olives, chopped parsley, a little bit of white vinegar, a little bit of mustard, and last but not least butter. And we mix that into a paste. And we put that on the white bread. Okay let's give this ham and olive sandwich a go. You get the brininess of the olives, you get the uh, Tanginess from the vinegar and the mustard. Mm, parsley is a nice little parsley touch. I am going to plus it up though. I'm going to add some Swiss cheese. Then under the broiler. Okay, let's give this plussed up ham and olive sandwich a go. And this is pretty interesting. Because the base was butter and not mayonnaise, it melted into the bread, but down below. The Swiss cheese goes with everything in there. And what's great is the inside of the sandwich is toasted because I put the top in. So even though the toast is on the inside, it's still crunchy. So I get a texture bump and I get a flavor bump with the Swiss cheese. Nice. Okay, so the original ham and olive sandwich, much more interesting than just straight up ham and olive. I would probably give that a seven. That was pretty good with the, the vinegar and the mustard tang, a little bit of parsley. Adding the Swiss cheese and then broiling it so you get a little crispiness on the, the bread and you get that melty cheese to go with everything. That's that's easily like eight and a half. I'm definitely going to finish that. <laughs> All right. See you tomorrow. Oh.